And the country's top economic policymakers are meeting as we speak over some of the daunting issues threatening the country's efforts to steady the economy. Following the escalation of trade tensions between the U.S. and China, and the country's latest disappointing job figures that showed no sign of improvement. For more, we get the latest from our one Zhong Huan, who's been following the story for us. So, Zhong Huan, what was the meeting about? Hi, ji Finance Minister Kim dong yeon and the heads of ministries related to the economy have gathered together at 10 a.m. to discuss the urgent economic issues impacting the country. They have met to discuss ways to deal with global trade issues amid an escalating trade war between the United States and China. The government is worried because the growing trade spat between the world's two superpowers could wreak havoc on Korean exporters, as the U.S. and China are the Korea's top two export markets. And another critical issue that has been discussed during the meeting today, the recent jobs report. The latest job figures by Statistics Korea show the country only saw its job growth remain in the 100,000 level in June. The fifth straight month, it has been in that range. Financial Chief Kim dong yeon said that the employment situation will improve in a short amount of time and that the creation of new jobs should be led by innovative growth. He also mentioned measures to help low-income households as well. But we may see some more policy adjustments aimed at improving those job figures. Back to you, June.